Uh, of course I know. Uh, ah, do you think I forgot you? No, it's by 6 p.m. Yes, I know. By 6 p.m. this evening. Yes. Make sure you are there. I, I have a lot to discuss with you when you come. Oh, hold on. I'll call you back later. Your mother is already there. Mommy. Mommy, wait for like mother like that. Yeah, we know fun. Clearly, where's the You are. Yeah, right. I'm fine. How what did it go? My friend, I bought it. Uh, Who was with your phone? Uh, Obina, my friend. Obina, okay, okay, yes, okay. Uh, I will have a meeting this evening. I remember. By six. <laughs> that means I have to rush and cook so that I will eat that before good. going. I want to eat before going. As usual, now. Uh, of course. Uh, what did you buy for me? Come inside. No, 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 no. Tell me, tell me. Oh, this is your suspense. I don't like it will every you, time. Don't will tell me. You, will you eat it outside? Come inside. Okay, come, 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 come. Come. Okay. Darling. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Are you okay? I don't care. I know that's exactly what you want from me. <laughs> Darling, mm -hmm. it's always good to have a good wife mm -hmm. who knows the best and the right diet in each point in time. You see, it's good. Well, after taking heavy food in the afternoon, in the night, you need to step it down with fruits. <laughs> <laughs> That's me for you. Yes, yes. Uh, Oliver, are you not? What are you not taking? I want orange. You want orange? Oh. I take orange. I take orange. Daddy, no, I want orange. <laughs> I like orange. <laughs> More than the yeah. I want you orange. You can have this one. Mm. You can have it. Only more go. Eat all of them. I don't joke with fruits, you know. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Don't have it. Let me have it. Mm. <laughs> Only more go. Guys, I'll eat it. Oh, yeah, you have one. Friend, this one you are buying drink for us. What are we celebrating? Me. I am surprised though, for the first time, he's bringing, buying drinks for all of us. Uh, tell us what it's no, the, reason for, the reason for our celebration. Okay, okay. Oh, see, yeah, so see. Look. Just relax. Enjoy your drinks. Today, I am very, very happy. Okay, okay, okay. See what happens. Uh, I'm ready to drink more, more, more. I am more. very, very happy. I'm overwhelmed. Hey, you know what happened? My first son, you know him now? Yeah. He gained admission into secondary school. Hey, that's lovely. Woo! That's <laughs> great. I'm very happy. Uh, thank I'm God very happy for that. Thank God for that. And okay. you know what that means? In the next six to seven years, he will be going to the university. <laughs> so it's, it's always good for a man to have a male child. Please, hey, stop that. All children are gifts from God, whether male or female. Yes, I know that children I give from God, whether male or female, but every man is supposed to have a male child because if you end up having just female children, mm -hmm. one day they will all get married and go to their husband's I house. I said it's okay. Let's drop that discussion now. What have I said wrong now? Please, just end it there. End it there. Uh, but, but, but you know what I'm saying is true now. Uh, your lineage will close off now. Please, please, please stop that. Children are a gift from God. Let us stop this argument. Male or female is a gift from God. Please, let us enjoy ourselves. Please, I'm serious. Uh, uh, please, excuse me. I don't remember that I have uh, an appointment with this time. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, now. Mm -hmm. See you next time. Okay. I'll call you later. I'll call you later. Where is he going? If you're going to hear also. Uh, so what did I do? What did you do? What did I do? Talking about male, 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 male. You're not someone like home. You have only female children. And we are here talking about male, 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 this and that. Uh, how is that my business? It's uh, not, it's not after all, it's, it's my money we are spending here. So? I yeah. called him here, bought him drinks, and he's so? him. Then let him go. What you are saying, is he right? If it's you, will you stay here and listen to all those rubbish? Ah. Uh, Please drink your drink if you want more, they, they will get more drinks for you. Ah, uh, can't I talk again? 
It's unfair. Please, send me that. Drink, drink if you want to drink. Ah. Meaning of what? I don't get it. What is it? What to eat before going to work? Did I ask you to prepare food for me? Or did I tell you that I'm hungry? But you've not taken breakfast for Christ's sake. Must I take breakfast? Is it more that I'll take breakfast? I dropped food for you on the I day. don't want to eat. I'm not hungry. And let me warn you. Henceforth, if I did not ask you to prepare food for me, don't prepare food for me. Stop wasting food. If I ask you that I'm hungry, prepare food for me. You prepare. Don't just go ahead and prepare food anyhow. Enough. Mommy. Oh, my Mommy, what is the matter? What happened? What? What happened? Nothing. We heard voices. Oh, I was discussing with your dad. Mommy, oh, stop pretending. You look worried. Ah, you look Do worried. I? Yes. But I'm not worried. Are you sure you're okay, Mommy? No, I'm very okay, I'm sure. I'm sure, my king, my beautiful girls. Are you sure you're okay? My Oboda <laughs> Yvonne girls. I'm very okay, my future hopes. If you can stay still, Mommy. I'm very okay. okay you're you set to go. Stay. Yes, yeah. Mommy. We are about going to the market. What do you want to buy for me? Name it. Anything you want. Just one apple. Apple. I'm okay. You have it, Mommy. Okay. All right, Mom. Take care. Please don't show sure you are okay, mommy. Hey, I am very okay. Am I not okay? I can see that, mommy. I'm Bye. okay. More than okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna come back. I'm missing you guys already, All okay? Right, don't stay long. Alright, thank you, mommy. Oh, my dear. Okay, don't stay late, oh. Okay. Please, don't be long. I'm missing you guys already. Sorry, you are here. Yeah. 
I'm so sorry, though. I went to somewhere. Let me open the gate for you. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. Sorry for keeping you. Hello. What is really the problem? I mean, you are so worried. Ichi, I'm fine. You mean you are, you are fine? I'm okay. Don't, don't hide anything. Tell me about the problem. What is the problem? Anyway, it's nothing but your brother. My brother? Yes. What about my brother? Your brother is not that man I got married to. He's just a different man, totally. All because I couldn't give him a male child. That's all. Male child? Well, no way also. I mean, when do we have to, uh, to challenge God? Oh. Do you know that... Uh, um, either female or male child depends on God. It's not your business. Oh. I would like to talk to him when he comes back. Okay. Eh? I have to talk to him. Bakaki Nola, come inside first to have rest. You've been under the sun for a while. Oh. Come and have rest, please. Okay? Mm -hmm. You can go, Dogu. <laughs> ah, okay. And you? Uh, let's make it on Friday. 6 p.m. as usual. Is all right. Uh, I'll call you back. Uh, good news. Good news. I went to the hospital today and the doctor said I am six weeks pregnant. Oh, the doctor said you are six weeks pregnant? Yes. Okay, so what do you want me to do? I should start dancing or jumping up because the doctor said you are six weeks pregnant. <laughs> Is it the first or the second one? Die. <laughs> Just pray that God will help you. And this one will not be another female child. <laughs> if it happens to be, mm, let me not say what I would do, but you know what will happen. Uh, uh, sorry for just a little distraction. I'm sorry about that. Uh -huh, as I was saying now, um, Friday evening, 6 p.m. Uh, yes, now, uh, that's it. Don't worry, children are a gift from God, whether male or a female, they are a gift from God. Yes, Pastor, I know. And I've tried all my possible best to make him understand this. But all my effort proved abortive. I don't really know what to do again. I am confused and I'm worried, honestly. 
don't worry. I will personally go and talk to him. Okay. Meanwhile, you should be prayerful. With prayer, you overcome. With prayer, you conquer. Let's pray. Father, we thank you. We give you all that glory. We thank you for the life of your daughter. We thank you for this family. Your word said, the expectation of the righteous shall not be cut off. Meet her in the point of view. In that Tired too. Ah. And mommy, I think um, we should always go to that pastor for prayers. Maybe through him, God might perform miracle. And do you also remember what the pastor said? That we should be prayerful at all times. Do you still remember? Yes, I remember. I remember my daughter and uh, God's strength in me will definitely see me through. Amen. One day I will conquer. Amen. I'm going to fix something for lunch. I'm damn hungry, honestly. I know. <laughs> please. Okay. Uh, but mommy, mm -hmm. please come inside and freshen up. I will. Give this to you. Okay. I'm coming. Yeah, Let me just here. get some fresh air. Alright. Hi, cold. Mr. Kafo. Uh, good day, Pastor. Pastor, what brought you here? I was on my way to, to your house and I saw your car path outside and I decided to come and talk to you. You're on your way to my house. Yeah. And you saw my car outside. Yeah. And you decided to come and talk to me. Pastor, in the first place, why were you going to my house? And what do you want to discuss with me? Your wife had earlier reported you to me about the male child issue that are going on in the family. My wife yeah. reported me to you about the issue of male child in my family. Yeah. Mm, that's good. Uh, Pastor, thank you for your concern. Hmm? This is family affairs. You can go. I will sort it out with my wife. Okay. Thank you. Good day. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, Mama. How are you doing? I thank God. This one, I saw uh, the pastor walking out from the drinking bar. I wonder shall never end. The pastor said, 
he was on his way to my house. He saw my car parked outside and he decided to come and uh, discuss with me. So I was asking him what kind of discussion, why were you going to my house in the first place and what do you want to discuss with me? So what did he tell you? He said my wife reported me to him about the issue I having in our family concerning male child. Can you imagine that? Mr. Kafo. That's exactly what brought me here. Uh, meaning, I don't understand. Your wife also reported you to me. Oh, my wife also reported yes. me to you. Yes. About the same issue. About not having a male child. Then what did you tell my wife? <laughs> Mr. Kafo. I believe anything the pastor told you, he was right. Okafo, why are you being so harsh on your wife? Is it her fault that she didn't give you a male child? Please, I'm begging you, take it easy on her. Oh, enough, enough of all this. You are saying this because you have a male child. Okay. If you are in my shoe, you will do more than what I'm doing now. Mr. Okafo, it's not that way. Please. I don't want you to break your family. With this, with, with, with how you are going, you will break your family. I will break my family. Yes, but I'm not going to break your own family. But my family. Now let's now let's think good. Let me just tell you: if you are here for us to drink as usual, let's drink. If you are here for my wife, family affair, whether male child or, or female child or whatever, then if that is why you are here. You can leave now. I want to be left alone. Mr. Kafo, think about it. Don't break your family. Obi, I don't care. If that will cause our relationship, our friendship, let it be. Nonsense. Okay, so that's what my wife do. I will deal with her. Too. So, do you know what happened? Mommy, tell me something. Hey, hey. As I was about to shoot the mark, I fell inside the gutter. But thank God, the, the gutter wasn't too deep like that. Are you serious? What yeah. did you fall? I fell as in, I fell yakata. No balance. Are you for real? I forgot I wasn't the, the, the ngozi I used to be. I'm telling you. I'm waiting for you. Hey! Oh my God, I'm I can't wait. Are you serious? Ngozi! Ngozi! What is wrong with you? So all you know how to do now is to gossip me, right? I don't understand. What is the matter? Explain me this. Don't pretend you don't know what I'm talking about. Ngozi, you have the courage to go to your pastor and report me, and you also reported me to my friend Obina. I don't care who you report me to. All I care is I need something from you. If you like, you can go to Rome. Report me to Pope. I don't care. All I need from you is a male child. Because why are you so wicked? You want to end my lineage? You are wicked. What is wrong with you? Give the male child. Oni, it is not what you think. I need peace, my husband. I need peace. Where is that peace? that brought us together as husband and wife. We love ourselves, my husband. Let us embrace that love. I reported you to my pastor and also your friend Obina. Yes, I did that because I want them to plead with you. I don't do it in, name of, in the name of gossip or whatever. You need peace. peace. Yes. You need peace. You will get peace. On what condition? That is if you will pray to God to convert what is in that stomach. And the only way you can have peace in this house is when you give me a male child. That is funny! Shut up! How dare you? Are you out of your mind? Are you crazy? How dare you talk to me? Nonsense! Nothing! Nothing! I'm okay. Are you sure? I'm okay. 
Let's go in. Don't worry. Leave her. Leave her there. Go inside. Mommy. Um, please, don't take anything that is said to her. I believe that this baby you're having here is already a male child, okay? Mommy, relax, okay? Remember what the pastor said. With prayer, we shall conquer, okay? Please. And secondly, Mom, if you notice, I think Daddy's tipsy. Daddy didn't come back home with his car or his briefcase. I think Daddy's tipsy. You're right. Yes, I think that's he's true. Tipsy. That's true. You did it. Yes, ma. Ah, what is happening? Mommy, just calm down. I'll just be fine. Mommy, smile for me now. <laughs> smile. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, welcome, sir. Thank you, 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 sir. you, Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, you, mean? I called Okafo yesterday morning. And what about him? What's the problem? Okay, come straight. Uncle, mm. Okafo is causing real problems in his family. Hey. Okafo wants his family to break. And if he's not taken care of, <laughs> that family will break. Uncle, you need to go and talk to Okafo. You need to talk to Okafo before it's late. Um, if that is the case, I think it's uh, high time I start going to the place in here. Uncle, in oh, uh, suppose, uh, can you go with me? Can we go together? Uh, I would have gone with you immediately, but I need to go to my house and collect something. I will meet you there. You mean you'll see me there? I will meet you there, Uncle. It's alright. It's alright. Right. 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 So let me just get something. I'll I follow you. Traveling tomorrow morning. I feel it's necessary. I'll let you know. Traveling? I'll be traveling. I'll be traveling. To where? Anywhere you want to know. It's for a business trip. But uh, by now, you're supposed to have forgotten about anything traveling. Why? Very soon I will put to bed. How does that concern me? Am I a nurse? Or am I a, a, a matron or doctor? Uh, I don't get it. I don't get it. Uh, do it the normal way now. You know the normal way of doing it. So, I don't think you need me around. Uh, but truth remains that I am traveling. Whether you like it or not, that is final.
Are you traveling? Yes, I am traveling. Help me up a little bit. tell you he will be traveling. He said so. What is it? Your dad. He's not picking my call still. Again? Mm. I will not die. This is serious. <laughs> Friend traveled. Okay, he traveled. He's okay. No problems. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll be there right away. I'll be there right away.
Good evening. Good evening. Take him, man. Uh, I don't uh, mind, dear. Let's go inside. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm in a hurry. I have somewhere I want to rush to. It's just that I got your call. So I decided to come and see you. Thank you, my dear. So, my friend, Okafo traveled without telling me. If you nah, man, eh? If you it's well. That is his own style now. It's well, no problem. Uh, please, just manage this. Manage it. Hey. Just Ubinna. manage it. Thank you so much. It's well. What would I have done without you? Don't hesitate to call me anytime you need help. Please. Mm. Anytime, just call me, I'll be there. Thank you so much. God bless you. God bless you. Take care of yourself what, and the kids. What would I have done without you? Don't mention. Hi. It's well. Just remember, call me anytime you need help. I will. Do I have any other person? Thank you, my Hi. dear. Oh? Yeah, I'm walking to somewhere. Oh. Hi, dear. I'll see you later. Oh. Okay, my dear. Hi. God bless you. God bless you. Mm -hmm. Call me. We have money now. Only how much? You can't see. Go and finish what you are doing. <laughs> I'm going to take my own. Oh, thank you. Thank you. In Jesus' name, Amen. in the mighty name of Amen. Jesus, Amen. Father, we commit this family into your heavy hands. Amen. King of glory, we thank you for gift of life. Amen. Father, we also commit our Father into your hands. Bless him, Lord. Bless his business. Father, also bring him back safely to us in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Father, Lord, we commit our mother in your hands. Please bless her and come and meet her at her point of need. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. As we are about to go to bed tonight, sleep. Father, come and take absolute control and protect us in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. And so shall we be in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. We cover our lives with the blood of Jesus Lord Christ. Jesus. We cover this family with the blood of Jesus Lord Christ. Christ. Hello, everybody. Yes, ma'am. Come. Mom, are you okay? I am fine. Go joy for me. Okay. But, Mom, are you sure you're okay? Just go joy. I'm okay. Okay, Mom. Hi. Hi. I wish. Joy. Joy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mommy, I don't know what's wrong with mommy. Mommy's coming. Mommy's coming. Mommy's coming. Mommy's coming. There's no problem. Um, though I'm not feeling so much good, but I think it's all about my baby. Mom, mom. Yeah. please have a seat. No, 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 no. I want to go and see my doctor in the hospital. Can we come along? No, get my bag for me. That bag, the one I packed things inside. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. don't be so worried. Just pray. Eh? That I come out safely. Oh? Okay, mm -hmm. you Can you get on? Eh? Help me, help me. Are you serious? 
Even I die, it's not your fault. Do you know what? Don't worry, I'm coming over to the hospital to see you. I'm coming over to see you. friends for you don't need to thank me your husband is my best friend so anything I do for you it's nothing Ovinna my dear do you know that your friend my husband refused picking my calls ever since I called him and told him I gave birth to a baby girl you are not serious. I am serious. But I am. You mean he stopped picking your calls just because you get back to another girl? This is ridiculous. Fugunin. No problems. I will call him later. Uncle Dina, thank you very much. We really appreciate. Thank you. Yes, uncle. Thank you. You don't push to stop all this thank you, thank you thing now. We are family. Mm, I better take my leave. I have something to tidy at the office. No problem. I'll be checking on you guys once in a while. God bless you, my dear. Thank you. God, this baby for me. Oh. <laughs> Mommy, let me see him. Oh. Okay, my dear. I will take care of my baby. Oh. <laughs> I don't know do you, boom. <laughs> It doesn't matter. I will you chill anyone. Mm -hmm. Hi. Sleepy, <laughs> sleepy. Why, 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 why are you this heartless? Why are you this heartless? Why are you treating this woman like this? What if you are coming? Oh, Jack, you are What you are doing is is, is unfair. Yes, yes, she gave birth to the girls, and so you are the one that impregnated her, and she gave what you what you gave to her. It's unfair. Oh. I don't, why, why are you just like this? It's unfair. It's unfair. I don't like it. It's unfair. Let me call uncle. Hello, uncle. Good morning, sir. Uncle, there's an emergency. I really need to see you. I really need to see you. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. I'm coming to your house, sir. I'm coming to your house, sir. Thank you. your mommy. Pastor, she's fine. I come to see her. Okay, let me call her. She's inside. Help. Mommy! Mommy, Pastor is here. Can't call me, no. Ah. Oh, welcome, Pastor. Thank you, my dear. Hey, you're highly welcome. Yes. Hey. Thank you. 
chai. Oh, wow. What do we offer you, sir? I'm okay. Eh? Not even water. Yes, I'm okay. Okay, if you say so. I heard that you put to bed and I come to see you. <laughs> yes, so the good Lord has done it for me. And I'm so happy for that. How is baby and your elf? My baby is looking good. She's okay, by the grace of God. And as for health, I don't have any problem. All glory to God Almighty. How about your husband? Ah, well, so... Anyway, let's hope he's good wherever he is. Because for a while now, I've not heard from him or seen him. What? That is it. My dear, don't worry. Your husband will come back to you safely. Amen. He will come back to you safely. But then, you should be prayerful. Okay. Prayer is the only way. Prayer is the solution. Amen. I may take my leave. So soon. Anyway, <laughs> you always a uh, busy. Yes, you're always busy in your church, so I don't blame you. John! John! Yes, mommy! Please, oh. Come and see me. Come on. Let's go. Please see him off, please. <laughs> see him off. Okay. thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Please, oh. Always remember our secrets. Yes. Yeah. Okay? Janet, what is it? Zingozio. Ngozi. What about her? She has been having problem in her marriage. I don't understand. Is she having any problem with the husband? Yes. The issue is her inability to give her husband a male child. I don't understand. What is wrong with that man? Is he not what you planted in a woman that the woman would deliver? What is wrong with him? That is not all. Though. Last week she gave birth. When she called her husband that she gave birth to a female child. Do you know that the husband did not even visit the hospital till date? It was Obina, his friend, that bailed them from the hospital. Jesus Christ. Wonder shall never end. So, Janet, all this has been happening and you do not even care to tell me. You're just telling me now. Huh? I have to go and see the uncle right away. I'll be right back. What nonsense. Um... Chief Eric, the reason I am here is uh, as a result of my niece's inability to give your brother's son a male child. And since that time, he has been treating my niece as if she's not a human being. I, I, I am so, so, so angry. I'm so angry with the way your, your brother's son is treating my niece. Just because she could not have a male child. I just came to find out if you are aware of all these things. Onukuwe. Uh, please. I ask you to calm down. Hmm? Calm down. Everything will be okay. Every problem will be resolved. And your ideas will be. Uh, comfortable in her husband's house. I promise you, this. Chief, are you also aware that your brother's son did not take responsibility when she gave birth in the hospital? He did not even pay the hospital bill. It was Obina, his friend, that cleared all the bills and go as far as dropping her in her house. Are you also aware of this? Calm down. That is the only thing I tell you. Just come to calm down. You are a man, everything will be resolved, okay? Take it easy. Hmm? 
the truth is that I am not happy about all these things that your brother's son is doing. Just, it's okay. Let me just take you back. Yes, yes, please. I want to apologize to you for all I've put you through. The pains, the agony, in the name of not giving me a male child. Actually, if you're in my shoes, you will do the same thing. You see, the fact remains that every man, every family needs a male child. I will take over from the man. Well, look at us. Uh, really, we have female children. But you know, they will grow up and get married, and the two of us will be left alone. <laughs> Age is no more on our side. Think of our, uh, think of our business. We need somebody to take over the business from us. So that is exactly the angle I am seeing it from. So understand with me, please. That is exactly what I am saying. So I am sorry, truly sorry. But you should know that children is a gift from God. You cannot choose for yourself the sex of your baby. Yes, it is not done that way. God has it all. It is not in my power to decide for ourselves. If it is in my power, I would have given you a male child ever before now. Let us wait for God's time because God's time is the best. Yes, you, you are right. Uh, I so much believe that God's time is always the best. You know, we've been praying and believing God for His time. So when will His time be? Anyway, um, we'll still try one more. Let's try one more. And uh, believe that God will answer us. Uh, but if we try, I eventually uh, turn out on the other side. If you understand what I'm saying. I will not be happy and that will push me to think about getting a second wife. Uh, you so much love me. I don't know how you will feel about that. I don't know if actually you can withstand that. You know, because definitely I'll put it point blank to you that uh, my love for you will be divided. I'll have divided attention if I have another woman in the house. More especially if she gives me a male child. So the ball is in your court. If you know how to cry to your God, pray to your God, if it will cause you to uh, uh, go on the mountains and pray 40 days, fasting for 40 days, 40 nights, anyhow you will do it, cry to touch the heart of God to save you. That is it. Because this is the only thing that can keep two of us in this house. Otherwise, let me just leave it at this. Is there any food in the house? I'm hungry. Can I have food to eat? Chai, sister, you mean he wants you to leave the house? Sister, you have to do everything possible to stay back in that marriage. You're not going anywhere. You don't even need to come back to this house. Mm. I think I have a solution. The problem here is, will you subscribe to it? In my way, mona again, I live where, where. I get me free here fast, so ha. My dear, there is something I want us to discuss. What could that be? I'm worried about my sister's predicament. I don't want her to leave her marriage. I don't want her to lose her husband. God forbid. Nothing of such will happen. Listen, let me tell you something. There's nothing anyone can do about it. 
The only person that has answers to all this problem is God. It is only God that gives a male child. It's only God that gives children. There's nothing no one can do about it. All we need to do is to go to God in prayer and God will surely answer us. Okay? She will not lose her marriage. She will not lose her husband. But we have to do something about it. That is what I am telling you. The only thing we all have to do about it is to go to God in prayers. Okay? So that God will answer our prayer by giving her a male child. That's the only thing we can do. Or do you have uh, any other suggestion? No. Good. Let us all trust in God. God will do it. Amen. No. Good. <sighs> well, what do I do now? What do I do? I'm confused. Janet, my sister, might be right, but how does it look? Can I do such a thing? Stepping out to go and look for another man in the name of looking for a baby boy. Uh -uh. Baby girl is also a child to me. I don't think I can do such. In fact, I'm confused. She just made a point anyway, but it would have been better if it happens that way. At least my husband can rest and I can have peace. But in the sight of God, it is not good. It is against my wish, against my religion. No, I cannot do that. Jane, my sister, I have checked all that you told me and I don't see any reason for doing it. I cannot do it. How can I, Ngozi, go to a man and start saying one rubbish or another just because I need a male child? I cannot do that, please. It's against my wish. Sister, don't worry, I will help you out. Nembiko, don't help me. You see, in this area, don't help me. I don't, in fact, I don't need anybody's help. Let everybody be on his or her own. Let me rest. If you say so. Yes. Are you sure? I am okay the way I am. Forget about it. Everybody should leave me alone. Ah, let's have a fall. Let me see how possible it is. Ah. Another female child. What is going on? She gave me hope that it's going to be a male child. And honestly, I thought that this time around, it's going to be a male child. God, what is happening with me? This woman has deceived me. She gave me every assurance that it's going to be a male child. And I thought that it would be a male child. Look at it again. Another female child. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. It is my fault. Because I was deceived. I was carried away by her beauty. Before I got married to her, my spirit told me that I should not marry her. Because in their lineage, they don't have male children. It's only female, female children. Her grandmother had only female children. Her mother, the same thing. I didn't listen to my mind. Now, 
I want to take another wife. The pressure for my uncle, my friend, my family members is much on me. What was I would have married another woman? So what, what do I do? Hmm? All these female children, here and there, they will get married and they will leave us alone. Or hey. Chokamamchi. God, I don't know what to do. Gods of my ancestors, help me. I think I need to take a decision as a man. Now. I will, I, will, I, will, I will drive out of my house. Yes, with her female children. That is what I will do. Yes. And nothing can stop me. I've made up my mind. And I will do exactly what I have decided to do. To understand exactly what I'm talking about. Yes. So I have told you several times not to blame your wife uh, for not uh, giving you male children. Hmm? It's not her fault. Yes. You see, uh, uh, for example, uh, your own grandfather, that is my own father, had about four female children. I am the last out of the five. I am the only survival male out of the out of them. You are mother. That is my only immediate elder sister. I had about five chi five female children, and you are the last surviving uh, male child out of them. So you can see now that the fault is not from your wife. Hmm? It's from our lineage. Uh, 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 if I understand you well, so what you are saying that in our lineage, you are trying to tell me that uh, 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 four female children will always come before a male child, which is the fifth one, and that will be the last child. That is what you are saying. Yes. Because it happened to your own father, which is my grandfather and my mother. So you are not telling me that uh, I should keep waiting. Since my wife now has three female children, I should wait for the next one that will make it four, four female. Then before the, the, the last one will be male, Uncle, I cannot keep waiting. Time is no more on my side. Age is not on my side. I can't have that kind of patience. It could be. Ghost time is the best. This is exactly what I'm trying to tell you. Eh? What, okay, what if I agree to, to wait? Till that time, and it, it, it doesn't happen again. Things can change. And things can change. You cannot challenge God. God knows everything. He knows I've, I've, God, I've had you. I've had you. So, so the the problem now is for me to bring her back. I've accepted. I will bring her back. I think there's no problem again. Eh? But hmm, on one condition, though, if if she comes back and she happened to get pregnant again and uh, 
give birth to a female child, that would be the end of the whole thing. I will, I will, I will, I will drive her away and I will have nothing to do with her again in this life. Thank you. Because time is the best. You consider it done that Almighty God is very capable of doing anything for you at his convenient time. Hmm? This is exactly what I'm telling you. And you, when, you, when you take it, you see everything is very, 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 very easy. Okay, Uncle, you are overflowing this matter. As I've had you. I, I've had you, I've had you. What, what, what else do you want me to do? I've had you. It's okay. It's all right. I know I'm a mad of a mad of a mad Chief Eric, what are you doing here? What are you doing in my house? After your brother's son treated my niece like a common rag. You're coming to my house, please. Why are you here? Calm down, calm down. You're supposed to be a man now. Eh? Calm down. You see, so I'm very sorry about uh, my, my uh, brother's uh, son's uh, behavior against you, please. Eh? Forgive Biko, me. Biko. Hmm? Baralo, baralo. Hey. Biko Kene. Ne, please help us beg, beg your sister, hmm? beg your brother too. Because yes, yes. we are sorry, we are very sorry. Yeah. What is that, Janet? Janet. Okay, Janet, please, please help us uh, too now. Beg your sister so that she can allow us now go with her. Hmm? Please, we are sorry. Yeah? We are very sorry, uh, Janet. You see, Biko, can you please help us uh, talk to your sister? Hmm? Please, we are sorry. Yeah? We are very sorry. <sighs> Janet, please uh, go inside and call on Gozi. I'm coming and sit down. Thank, Thank you. you. How are you? Yeah, Jenna just called me and told me of the good news. Hey, we thank God. Hey, uh, hey, thank God. Thank God for safe delivery. You are still at the... Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I will see you guys a bit later. Let me finish what I'm doing. I, I will surely come to the hospital. <laughs> me, I will come to the hospital and see you guys. Good day, every one of you. I, I want to say that my heart is filled with joy. Uh, and I must also appreciate all of you for honoring my invitation. Uh, not minding the urgency of it. Uh, I want to say that uh, God is great and faithful. Uh, I want to, I don't even know how to start because my heart is filled with joy. So I just called all of you to let you know that the long awaited miracle would be expecting has finally arrived that is uh, i now have a male child Ogajolo. <laughs> my son Ogajolo. <laughs> i 
I appreciate God. That really made me to understand that God's time is always the best. All we need in this life is patience, endurance. When it is God's time, nothing, I mean nothing can stop it. So um, anyway, I have um, a token of my appreciation. The big celebration is on the way. Uh, so this one is just, uh, just for you to say, God, thank you that you answered my prayers. By God's grace, I'll plan for the big occasion when it will be done in the way it's supposed to be done. So I want to say once again, thank you. Uh, my thanks go to my uncle here, Uncle Eric. Thank you for being there for me. Um, <laughs> my good friend. <laughs> my beloved friend of dinner. You are happy now. <laughs> Thank you very much. I am happy. Uh, my pastor. God bless you, Lord. God bless you. God bless you too. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you for your good work. And the work of evangelism you are doing in this our town. And uh, <laughs> my lovely wife. God bless you. Yes, I, I see. Sorry for all I put you through. <laughs> the pace, the agony. We are now rejoicing. We are happy. God bless you all. God bless you all. And God bless you all. In Jesus' name. Oh. Amen. Amen. Thank you all. Oh. Um, let me also use this opportunity to thank you all, especially Obina. You are just a God sent to me and my family and also each year thank you so much my pastor I appreciate you and I will also thank my beautiful daughters that stood by me and also my old Juru who decided just to wipe away my tears I am so happy for this day I really thank God for this wonderful day Hi, um, God, your faith. No, without wasting much of your time, <laughs> like they said, give honor to whom honor is due. So I will hand this over to my uncle. He's the eldest. Uncle, please, you know what to do. Yes. Sir. Over to you. We appreciate it. Hey, 